The other day I was perusing through satellite imagery, as one does, and I found a really cool loop in southern Georgia as seen here. An area of darkness formed in a sea of white puffy clouds. How did this feature form? Okay, let's science. <laughs> Let's start by looking at this loop a couple of times. You can find this loop and other loops at your favorite Go16 provider. Mine is Sierra Ram Slider. You can find the link in the description to find all sorts of really, really cool stuff. Let's dissect this loop. The first thing we see here is an area of fair weather cumulus clouds as denoted by the white little dots that kind of sort of bubble over and over and over again. These fair weather cumulus clouds form when the sun heats the surface and then the surface heats the air above the ground forming small areas of warmer air. These hot pockets of air, throw back to middle school lunch, Kidding aside, these pockets of air begin to rise, and as they rise, the water vapor inside them begins to condense, forming clouds. But as we see in this loop, the clouds are small and don't form into anything significant like a rain shower or thunderstorms. In this case, the air is rising just to sink back down once it reaches something called an atmospheric cap, which is a layer of relatively warm air that inhibits buoyant air from continuing to rise. One mechanism to break that cap is to heat the surface so much that rising air continues to be warmer and less dense than its surroundings, thus rising through the cap. This eventually happens right here. You can see the cumulus cloud grow larger and larger after breaking through. Eventually, this cloud grows enough to form rain. The rain then rushes out of the cloud falling to the surface. Along with the rain, cooler air actually flows to the ground as well. The relatively cool air can actually pond together, forming something called a cold pool. The cold pool does away with all the hard work the sun did, warming up the surface, warming up the air, and inhibits really any air from actually rising again until the ground can be heated again and then the air can be warmed again. It's a whole cycle. And that's exactly what we see here. The area of darkness is the cold pool with the edges denoted by puffy cumulus clouds. So yeah, that's really cool. The sun heated up the ground, the ground heated up the air, the air rose, clouds form, a rain shower formed, with eventually water and cooler air rushing to the surface, forming this void of clouds in a sea of puffy white cumulus. Science is awesome. Thanks for listening.